The simplest way I think of explaining cloud computing is to say, um, again, it's not a strategy, it's a tactic for your business. It's a way to think about getting applications and solutions up really rapidly in a rapid manner and not have to worry about all the security patches, not have to worry about all the infrastructure. So while cloud, it's not new, it's been around forever. We've, been ha we've had Xbox Live users, we've had MSN, there's something called SMS feeds where with Microsoft you've been getting your updates forever. So cloud is not new, but I would say it truly is a tactic, not a strategy to your business. But in a nutshell, it's a way to get things up very rapidly in an enterprise and not worry about all the infrastructure. I think what's possible is access at your fingertips anywhere, anytime, through any device. Um, you know, we're at Consumer Electronics Show right now. You saw some of them last night as Steve Ballmer spoke. But what will be available five years from now is rapid application development. Truly, again, you may be developing apps on your phone as you're sitting there. That's not available today. You still have a lot of coding, and it, but it gets easier every year. And I think five years from now, apps will be taking place very rapidly. Uh, ideas will be flowing, and we'll be able to explore those jointly across government as well as private sector. The thing that we've heard over and over for so long again is, how do you get things deployed? How do you get things out there? How do you innovate? And cloud is just, it is innovative in a sense because you can truly have the new technology at your fingertips overnight. And that's what the enterprises in federal government struggle with. I mean, it takes them years to deploy things and they really do want to have the latest and greatest at their fingertips. The second thing I would say for the federal government, cloud is really important because of COOP, things like continuity of operations. Uh, we've heard a lot from individuals that work in the uh, preparedness space about when there's a disaster, the lights go out. If you have a cloud environment, you can continue to be connected through mobile, through your laptop, as long as, there's a, as long as you have access. Try it. You've got to try it. Get on board within your agency, do some boot camps, go online, download some of the sandbox tools that's available to you on Azure or Live. Just try it, get out there, develop some applications, uh, make it a part of your roadmap for your individuals, your developers, your business people to really understand. Get them comfortable with it. But also, at the end of the day, you also have to have security in mind. So, it, so start sort of simple, let them get used to it, and just try it, and I think everybody's gonna be really excited about the outcome.